Hey everybody, welcome back. Jacob Bill, CEO of Build Enterprises. And on today's Tech Tuesday, we're going to be taking a look at a website and social media application called Social Blade, which generates a report card and raw data for your social media platform performance. And it's a completely free tool. And we're going to show you how it can drastically help your performance on these platforms. Stay tuned. Alright, so let's get the thing started. So we're going to go to our Google homepage and we're going to go ahead and type in Social Blade. Alright, so Social Blade is a really, really cool tool. Um, it's something that I have been using. I just actually recently got turned on to it. Um, and so there's two ways to use this. Either you can use it without, I'm going to go ahead and log out of my account here. Um, so we can go ahead and use it um, without an account or with an account. Uh, when you have with an account, you can get a little bit more of the nitty gritty um, when it comes to your own personal um, your own personal performance on these different social media platforms. But if you, for whatever reason, do not want to do that, you just don't want to do a quick check or whichever without logging in, we can go ahead and take a look at somebody just on their YouTube username. So we'll enter in my name here. And we're going to go ahead and pull me up. So this is going to go ahead and show, this is my official page right here, or my personal page, I have to say. Um, now, I have a I have a very, very new channel. I'm a pretty small YouTuber right now. I've been doing this for about around a month, even though I've had the account since, you know, 2013. Uh, back before, you know, back before it was cool, I guess, on Google. Um, and this is going to go ahead and show the last video. Uh, it does a total grade. So the grade performance literally is like a report card based on all the metrics that you see here. Your subscriber rank, video view rank, social blade rank, um, how many subscribers you've had the past 30 days, and then your earnings, et cetera, et cetera. So the algorithm takes all this data, converts it into a grade, and you can kind of take a look at how your performance is on the platform, which is really cool. This is another cool thing. Again, you can pull anybody up on this to kind of take a look at how they're doing, but it'll actually average out how you are doing. So since the 4th um, of August, we're going to go ahead and see how my video views have been and then what my daily averages have been since the 4th. And we can change these parameters around to take a look at your 30, 60, 90 days, etc. You can change that around when you do log in um, to your own or if you, again, if you're checking somebody else's out, you can go ahead and click see monthly statistics and this is going to send me all the way back to July 15th. And so you can kind of take a look at how you're averaging, how you're doing, uh, so on and so forth. Uh, and again, you can either check yourself this way or you can check other channels this way. So say if you want to, uh, say if you want to um, log in and, and see kind of more of a detail, we're going to go ahead and take a look at that. And there's a ton of tools on here. You know, you're, um, you can look up similar channels based on the keyword or tags on that channel. And then you can see future projections. So based on how I'm doing right now, and it bases everything on exponential growth, you can go ahead and see, okay, well, if I am doing this for, um, say, a year from now, 2020, August 20th, if the metric stays the same and I show exponential growth for a year, I'm looking at to get around 1,350 subs and about around 186,000 views based on exponential growth on the data already. So it's kind of a cool thing. I mean, you got to take it for a grain of salt because it is exponential, so it does compound um, as time gets further along for more growth, which in theory it should be how it works. But then again, you know, I mean, theory and reality is, is – is definitely um, different on certain cases. And again, you can see the exponential growth um, based on more subscribers, more views, et cetera, et cetera. So say you want to go ahead and, and have an account here. So, I mean, obviously you would register, register everything in, make sure you have a good email address and all that, all that good jazz. And then once you have it, you can go ahead and log in. So what they try to do with Social Blade is actually kind of a one-stop shop for a bunch of different things. We can go ahead and take a look um, at the supported platforms. So the support platforms, YouTube, Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Daily Motion, and Mixer, you can integrate all these platforms into this and kind of see how you're doing. 
um, and then your top list. So this is kind of cool. So you can take a look at like the top 50 YouTubers, the top 100 YouTube channels, and all that good stuff when it comes to YouTube. And you can do that with all of these different platforms. Um, and then you can get like your live real time count. And then they have uh, a lot of different products and services, which we'll go into. Um, and that is going to be the counseling. Um, they can counsel you on your channel. You can apply for premium membership so you can take advantage of some more tools. Currently, I have the free membership and I'm still kind of testing it out. I might go with the premium. We're just going to kind of see what the benefits would be on that. And then you can do your custom report generators. You can have other people manage your channel. And then again, like with the consulting, um, I do believe that they they claim something about around 45% in six weeks. And if you're interested in that, you can definitely take a look at that as well uh, but going into the tools that you do have uh, having a free registration for this is that you can mark some of your favorite channels so you can kind of take a look at but uh, I do like um, one of these features here oh again again and uh, on the authentication tab uh, if you do link your your channels here they do ask that you authenticate it meaning that you can say it's a right channel it's your channel and that helps keep the data integrity good so when you do sign up, definitely um, authenticate your channels. It really helps everybody out. Um, and then let's take a look at these favorites here. So um, on your favorites, you can list up to five favorites. And when you have them on your favorites, you can kind of check your, your process against some of your favorites process. Or if they're buddies yours, you kind of want to see how their growth is, you can add them too. So you can use it for comparison. You can use it for... Um, for really whatever purpose and you can have five on this on a free account and then uh, here is the compare right here so um, you can go ahead and compare different channels and this can either be your channel or a couple other channels if you're kind of rooting for one guy and not another guy or kind of just seeing how they're doing in comparison with each other and you definitely um, you definitely have that option as well so this is kind of the basics when it comes to social blade again with a more of a premium membership uh, you can do um, a lot of things on it this is just kind of a quick and dirty tutorial on kind of what it is or really kind of an overview what it is what it can do and different things that it can help you with um, but I really do like the averaging so going back to my channel here um, we'll go ahead and uh, click on my dashboard here and go to my YouTube um, I really 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 do like um, using this as um, as really my my raw data uh, my raw data collection here so this is really kind of the big thing I mean Google Plus really isn't a thing anymore and there is an option for that um, I just said Google my phone my phone was listening to me um, but again there's there really is a, quite a bit of resources here quite a bit of raw data um, and they also do have uh, business and tax services um, with this as well so um, if you're unfamiliar with um, with how that works um, because as a youtuber there are certain things you can write off because if you're doing YouTube for the intention of making money a for-profit venture um, there's a lot of things that you can do and a lot of people are familiar with that you know equipment travel the whole nine yards so there's a lot of things that you can take advantage and write off on this so this is definitely something if you want to consult with somebody outside of of who you normally do they do have these services here and they do have a blog too um, this is definitely somewhere um, where you can go in and, and kind of get some up-to-date information on what's happening on the platform I'm not a big drama guy they do have the drama alert channel which they do push fairly heavily um, it is a it looks like it is a featured or sponsored channel and I see them quite a bit uh, but they do have a lot of good news and a lot of good articles re related to um, to the platform on this as well so you can kind of you, know, you can kind of uh, uh, stay stay abreast on what's trending and what is uh, and what is really kind of relevant in regards to the platform so 
And again, they do have this, um, they do have this categorized as well for easier browsing. So again, so that's Social Blade. Um, if you are a YouTuber or if you are looking somewhere to get raw data, that's not going to be of any cost. Um, this is definitely a good place to start. It's not super, super, super in-depth. Uh, that would be with more of like a premium membership, but you can still do a lot um, with this, especially with the compare feature. Um, you know, if you're if you're really kind of gunning for somebody um, or if you are just wanting to get kind of more of an in-depth on different channels that you're wanting to either take market share from um, or kind of see what they're doing and what's been working. And again, with projections as well, that can kind of give you a realistic look on where you, how long it would take based off of what you're doing now to get to your goals. So if you're wanting to speed that up, obviously, you know, you're going to take a look at your projections and go, okay, well, if these numbers are showing me this, I'm going to ramp this up and hopefully um, I will get to where I want to be um, sooner and that could be for monetization or whichever so again um, if you like this content uh, please please um, subscribe to the channel and um, that definitely does help me and it does help encourage to continue producing this, this kind of content uh, if you uh, have any questions comments or concerns always leave uh, always leave a comment I respond to every comment on my channel um, just make sure that I'm producing content that is of value to people so and if I'm not definitely let me know you know let me know what I could do better or let me know if this wasn't really what you were looking for so I can do a better job next time because that's really what this is all about so um, anyways thank you for joining and hopefully this uh, provided some kind of uh, some kind of insight and some kind of value and I will see you all uh, on my next episode which will be on Wednesday all right take care bye